Hey, I'm Rachel, and this is Dress to the Nines. This week brought us the EMAs, CMAs, and the Soul Train Awards. Here we go with our red carpet roundup. Katy Perry looked like a vintage star at the EMAs in Amsterdam. For the red carpet, she donned a Zach Posen Resort 14 satin dress with simple Charlotte Olympian heat toe platform. Love that glam, Katie. Later that night in the photo room, Katie made them all roar in this black crochet dress with a solid black bodysuit, a Chanel link belt, and ankle strap sandals. You killed both looks, Katie. At the CMAs, Lucy Hale wore a beautiful halter dress from the Julian McDonald Spring 13 line. She matched the dress with these Ruthie Davis peep toe sandals. The embellished neckline of this gown is gorgeous and we love her dark pedicure, which made this a bit more fall. Lovely, Lucy. The gorgeous Natalie Portman wore Dior to a screening of Thor The Dark World in New York. Instead of a gown, she went for this multicolored strapless top and simple slim black pants. This look is straight off the Dior Fall 12 runway, except Natalie opted for a more pointed toe Dior pump. There really are so many options when it comes to fashion. Trendsetter Bella Thorne turned up at a party in LA looking as chic as ever. She opted for a patterned short sleeve Rebecca Minkoff dress with a sexy leg slit. I'm crushing hard on her black Bionda Castana booties with the gold embellishments. So hot! Nine West has these amazing black booties with gold embellished details called the Ezzy. These boots will jazz up any outfit and have you perfectly prepared for every holiday party. Want to get the look? Click here. Are you ready for Guess Who's Shoe? Which hot actress looked terrific in tweed this week? It's Jessica Chastain. The stunning actress attended an event honoring Karl Lagerfeld in New York. Jessica chose a Chanel Fall 13 Couture frock. When you see the rest of this collection, the looks are all broken up with a thick black low-waisted belt. I feel like Jessica should have worn one here to show off her shape a bit more. What do you guys think? All hail the queen, our shoe queen this week is Jennifer Hudson. The Svelte singer looked smashing in this black and white geometrical mini dress at the Soul Train Awards. Her body looks phenomenal in this Balmain Spring 12 dress. I think Jennifer looks better than the model did on the runway. The look is the same with the belt and the slick minimal style of hair. However, this dress shows off Jennifer's curves and her black Saint Laurent booties are crazy sexy. Jammin' Jennifer. It's time for Shoe Shock. Okay, so no one is shocked at the train wrecking ball that is Miley Cyrus. It's one thing to try and look trashy, but Miley outdid herself yet again at the EMA Awards. Ugh, she wore an uber revealing graphic dress that was more like a cut up shirt that covered nothing and featured pictures of Biggie and Tupac on it. She even managed to make those killer Tom Ford boots look bad. But that's just my opinion. I wanna know what you guys think, so leave comments below. Well, that's it for this week. Check back next week for an all new episode of Dress to the Nines. I'm Rachel, bye. To see more Dress to the Nines and other awesome programming for shoe lovers, make sure to subscribe to Nine West.